In New Brunswick, we preface all our calls with where is your emergency. Knowing someone's location is extremely critical. It allows us to coordinate a response. Where is the incident occurring? Where does that caller need help? PSAP stands for Public Safety Answering Points. We handle emergency and non-emergency calls for service for the City of Fredericton and surrounding areas in our region. Getting callers help the fastest way possible is always our goal. A few years ago, we had a lady leave the highway and her car plummeted into the St. John River. She called 911 from her phone uh, in the car. She wasn't able to get out of her car. We received the location information on her mapping. As a result, uh, one of the agencies responded and uh, a successful rescue from the vehicle pulled her from the icy waters. Every second counted in that scenario. We are responsible for public safety services, 911 services in the province, uh, which requires a mapping solution or GIS information that provides the right resource to the right location in the fastest way possible. For years, we were collecting and retrieving data from our municipal partners or other GIS authorities in the province, uh, either electronically or manually, and we were duplicating effort to create maps. So we needed to modernize the way we captured civic addressing and the way we captured road data and collect that together uh, in, in an ArcGIS uh, provided by Esri's suite of products. MB911 Bureau used to receive data in a variety of formats. People used to email, send letters, send spreadsheets. We weren't receiving a complete data set. Sometimes we would only receive new road information, and we used to have to recreate that data in our own systems. With the GeoExchange solution from Esri Canada, now we're receiving a complete data set. Not only the new street information, but we're receiving important information for the road attributes, such as remaps, range extensions, and deleted streets, which is all important to the 911 system when they're providing it to the dispatchers. Time does matter to our uh, public Public safety folks, the 911 centre, our fire crews, our police crews, the emergency ambulances. The advantage that this is providing obviously is that it's the most current information that we can possibly provide to them at this time. The data is retrieved nightly, it's processed through the system and built into a single provincial data set. One of the impetus for uh, finding these efficiencies in maintaining a road network data set for 911 is that we have a new 911 system mandated by the CRTC. So NG 911 or next generation 911 is really the next evolution of 911 here in Canada. Local government authorities or provincial aggregators will really need to have a complete and up-to-date GIS data set in order to be able to deliver 911 in the future. The model that we're building using Esri's GeoExchange solution can be replicated in any jurisdiction in Canada, allowing us to incorporate local government authorities' GIS data sets much more efficiently, much more effectively, and we are getting much more timely updates of their authoritative data. Our public safety answering points and our emergency service responders are able to have the correct data that they need to respond to an emergency. Prior to having integrated maps and the location data delivered right to the mapping, uh, we had to just go by caller's information. Now with integrated maps, uh, it automatically populates locations and uh, really enhances the response. Makes it a lot easier for the callers, as well as our call takers. If we don't do our job right on the GIS and the civic addressing part, then we compromise the 911 system. I would encourage any municipality that has a GIS environment to engage with their public safety answering points, ensure that they understand what the next generation 911 standards will require. There may be some methodologies that they need to, to put in place to be able to deliver that data in a more efficient fashion. And I think the GeoExchange is one of those tools that can assist with that.